Hello, and welcome to some more... Why is my microphone over? Uh, welcome to some more Satisfactory. My name is Tris Magistus, and it is face-meltingly hot today in the UK. Me levels. Yeah, that's all great. Lovely jubbly. Uh, yes, we are playing Satisfactory. I'm trying to get through the game. I've massively bitten off more than I can chew, I think. Um, and part of that is that I think I need to get some hard drives. I need to find some of these alternate recipes and maybe sw switch out what I'm doing uh, in some of the factories to use some of these alternate recipes. Uh, so there is actually one here. Basically, I need to find hard drives. So we're going to find slugs if and you know as we're going as well, because I don't actually have that many. After all those hours hunting, I've only ended up with 30 odd power shards. So uh, we'll probably do some slug hunting as well because we're not slug hunted in the desert. Slunted, as I like to call it. But yes, yeah, so there is a hard drive down here. Uh, uh, is that the hard drive or is that the hard drive? Uh, so we're going to be going around. I have got the map open because uh, there aren't as many hard drives as there are slugs. So, oops. Why did my backpack not kick in? Huh, interesting. Uh, yes, there are more sort of... There we go. What are we after? Oh, it doesn't need anything. Unless it took it... Oh, it must have taken it automatically, I think. So that's one. Um, now, there's quite a few, I think, up in the sort of deserty... Not the deserty. The sort of top left corner. There's also... Oh, we've got a beep. Uh, over here, I've not really looked in a few of these places, so, you know, I've never sort of really been over here. I think mainly in this one is because I sort of got attacked by spiders, basically. But where's that beep coming from? Oh, that way. Or is there something... Oh, it's on power slugs. Why is it on power slugs? Huh. Doesn't matter, though. I can just nip in and grab this. Why was that on power slots and not on hard drives? Out of range, it's saying. There's nothing there. Well, so I think there's a couple up here, but I so say there aren't actually that many. Like, full stop. Because there are only alternate recipes, so I don't know that there are a lot of alternate recipes. But So we'll sort of head off up into this corner of the map, really. Because I believe there are some over here. Uh, I think there's one that's fairly obvious when I was building the road, you know, the roadway. Um, I seem to recall. Uh, I've also got the map open so that I can find caves. Um, I'm a bit rubbish. Here we go. Was this the one? I might have already got it, but... Oh, it looks like I've probably already got it. Yeah, that was the one I was thinking about that was um, really close, I think. Oh, I see what you've seen around there. And then I think there was one shown on the map, like, over here somewhere. And there's things like... Uh, there's, like, a slug on the top there. You can see that one. So we can see if we can get up there. I'm going to have to swap my other... Keeps defaulting to power slugs. I wonder why it does that. So maybe there was a hard drive in that, and I just. So if I. Hard drives. No. No, looks like it was defunct. Whoops. Don't fall off there. In fact, let's put that on. Just in case I do something foolish. I'm surprised it's not beeping. Maybe I collected that one as well. Uh, so I've actually been working on the factory quite a lot. I, I sort of misspoke on Friday. Because I was like, oh, I'm not going to have time to do anything. Um, and actually I've had loads of time because... Um, oh, there's there we go. There's a hard drive. Now, how the heck do you access that area? Is that a... Oh, there we go. There's a little path down there. Definitely haven't been for this one, I don't think. Let's try not to rush down. Whoa. I'll fail that. 
Come on. It's sort of whipping around a bit. Uh, I'm sure there's bound to be some creatures or something. I think they tweaked it again with the creatures, because creatures seem to have disappeared again. Have we got anything here? Is there anything going to spawn here? No, it doesn't look like there is. I think they tweaked it and they've done they've flipped back to the opposite again, so. Oh, it's on power. Why does it keep defaulting to power slots? There we go. What do you need? Whatever it is, I'm obviously carrying it. But yeah, they seem to have flipped back to the creatures that don't appear again. Um and I, I you know. Hmm. Uh, I don't mind the creatures as such. It was just the whole them, you know, completely reappearing and even though you've got stuff built. Because what used to happen is where you'd built things, it wouldn't... Oh, look, is that a cave? It was just a weird arch. Just a weird arch. Let's just check the map quickly. Um, they didn't used to reappear. No, there's no cave over here. But there is one back there. Oops. Okay. See if I can make my way back up there. Yeah, they didn't, you know, they would stop spawning when you'd built some stuff in the area. And that update made them just respawn and irrelevant, ir irrespective of whether you'd built anything. So it was just getting a bit tedious. But now they seem to have just completely turned them off again. The crabs seem to work. But it doesn't seem to spawn in... Um, spitters in particular. Having said a which, there's probably a million spitters all now up here. But I think there's a cave here somewhere. There's certainly a snook. There we go. That looks sort of cavey, doesn't it? Is it pointing me at... Oh, this is the geezer. Okay. Because this is a water one. Yeah. And then isn't there a nitrogen? Because I thought... Well, that's water. I'm pretty sure there's a... Because like, I was mentioning before that I kind of need to... Where's this slug then? So it's underneath me. I think, which is why it's living on there. The trouble is, I don't know how I get in and out of this cave, because this is quite a drop. Hmm. Let's just have a look at the map, then. Because I've built a pathway down. So where am I? I am here. Yeah, so it appears to be a, a section that goes underneath there. Which I'm guessing is where the slug is. So, why is the map not closing? There we go. So let's build a little a little pathway down. See if we can't get into this cave. Because if it's like trapped underwater as it appears to be from you know, from what's there. Oh zoop. I'm not going to be able to get it anyway. Is there a... Oh, there we go. We've got a little thing. Oops! Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Let's float back to the surface. Okay. It's a yellow slug as well. That's nice. So, I guess I should get the gun... In case there's spiders. Whoa. Where's this thing? Oh, this has got to be. I mean, it's, it's, it's a temple, isn't it? Oh, and there's a, one of you lads as well. Oh, look at it. It's a temple. So there's nothing else in here, by the looks of things. Okay. Right, see if we can get back out. What are you? Uh, 
how would I do that? So maybe if I soup something out of here. There we go. There we go. But yeah, I was also going to look at uh, the geezers because I noticed on the map. Where's the... There it is. Where's the car? I noticed on the map, so it's all the way up there, that uh, there were some geezers over there. I didn't check out which they are, but if they're nitrogen, then that there's that car from when I fell off the cliff. <laughs> uh, so I don't want power slugs, do I? I want hard drives. Ooh, so there's a hard drive. Oh, you just... No? No? Huh. Showed a signal and then it sort of disappeared. Yeah, because I wanted to check these geese out. Because if one of these is nitrogen, that might solve the whole problem I was, you know, um, struggling with of um, how do I, you know, do these last couple of researches? Why is the research is not shown? Uh, are they just water geezers, though? This is the question, you see. Because this is a thing, isn't it? Hmm. Now, there was a, a slug up here somewhere, wasn't there? That I could see. So it looks like they might just be water geezers. Water geezer! I thought I saw a slug up on this cliffage. Can you see it? No. Let's let's just do a rampage up there because I bet there's something up there interesting anyway. Can I get up here? Okay. An inner entrance. Right. That's another Mercer sphere, you think? I see no slugs. I see no slugs. Do I have to get across to there? It doesn't look like there's any way to go. Let's get across here. You're going to float in the air, which is fine. Relay a message. Hello, this is Paternal Figure. I have taken ill and need your help to find a cure. Doctors say that the only remedy is alien artifacts. So if there's a slug up here, then it's not it's not here. Looks like it's probably up top somewhere. I'm not sure I brought that much concrete with me thinking about it. Uh, let's do it to there. And just sort of put, no, put one on the side. Okay. Where are you, my sluggy friend? Does this should go round and round and round? Doesn't appear to be going up. Oh, there we go. Up here. Whoops. Where the heck is this slug? Yeah, somewhat. Okay. Feels like I'm being super dumb. Oh, there we go. Anything guarding it? Purple one as well. They're worth like five. And oh, and there's another. Wait, is that a hard drive? What's that sticking outside then? Oh no. No, there's no hard drives. 
house looks. So there's another one. Okay. How do I get up there then? Gotta jump on here. Can I? Yep. It's gonna be on the top, isn't it? But I thought I saw one clinging to the wall. Just imagined it. Is there any way up? Okay. Right. Oops. Let's see here. See, I don't mind this sort of exploration. This isn't bad. Although it gets a bit annoying when you, you're doing it. It reminds me a lot, actually, of Red Dead Redemption 2, this. Oh, I can see the glowy effect. There you are. A yellow one. Any other bibs? Oh! So there's extra bibs down there. Hmm. Let's just nip off and... Where the heck is that one then? Oops. Ah, I see some glowy bits. I'm nowhere near my car, am I? There we go. That is the badger. Cool. But what I'm really after is hard drives. Oh. So it gives... Why did it give that flash? And then it's... Got nothing. Let's have a look and see on the map. Let's see. See if that's got any rough hint. Because there is there is one over here. Huh, it looks like there's actually a couple of caves. Like big caves. Which one am I on? So I'm there. So this one is the one with a couple of big caves in it. And then the hard drive is sort of up here somewhere. Which might be why it's giving the blip when I... You know, it's it's initially picking it up and then it's deciding... Yeah, you know, the code's deciding it's too far away. Okay. But where's my car? Yeah, it's down this way. Okay. Let's put it back on slugs. Nothing there. I'll just hop off. See if I can't drive over this falling of the waters. Got like gas on there. So say so apparently some big caves in this inside this. Why is that? Oh, it is spewing it, I guess. But you just can't see it. Ah. Oh, no. I thought that might be the hard drive. So I've not even been to this area, though, man. So some slugs again, but... Where's this hard drive? Can you show it to me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So maybe on top of this sort of thing over there on the right here, maybe it's hidden in all that gas. I can see a power slug up there. I so say the crabs are still here for some reason, but the other stuff doesn't seem to spawn anymore. So there you go. So they well they call them crabs. I don't I don't really see how they're crabs, but. So if I just unload into that, you. Go. Scrap 
this saloon. Okay. And... Any, so yeah, power stacks up there as well. Should I grab these? I deliberately sort of emptied out my inventory a bit this time. But I wonder if the... Oh, it's sort of saying in that direction. Okay, so maybe the hard drive isn't up the top there. I don't know, maybe it is. How would I get up there? I mean, with the power of jetpack, obviously, but... Just wondering if there's another... There we go, up here. It must be really fun making these maps. So that's the slug he was on about. I assume. Oops. Oh, I <laughs> thought we crashed then. But yeah, so I made a lot of progress with the um, iron and copper foundry. Um, so I may, oh, I may not redo that, you know, if we get some good alternate recipes. But there's still lots of factories that I would need to build in theory. Oh, the hard drive's up the top there, isn't it? Um, so I'm thinking maybe there's some alternate recipes that'll work for them. Can I not get up there? Ah, there we go. I can see a slug over there as well, so we can go and grab that one. Oh, what's that? Oh! Ah, this is nitrogen. Ah. Ha ha. So, let's put a marker on. I wonder why it doesn't reveal that. Can I put a marker on? So if I put... No, not that one. If I put... Uh, let's just put on that one, because I haven't used that particularly. No, if I do a proper marker. So it's not a stamp, is it? I want a marker. Why, why can't I... Oh, let's just put one of these up. Right, so this is the nitrogen. So it's not actually inaccessible. Inaccessible, right? I don't know how to build on it, though. Why do you actually build on it? It's got to be under production, hasn't it? So, resource well extractor and a resource well pressurizer. So, which does that go on? That goes on that one. Ah, oh, okay. So, you put that on the main one. And then these, presumably, on an activated fracking satellite. Activated freight. Does that mean this needs to be running? Yeah, looks like that probably needs to be running, and then I can put put it on the others. But that's not that's not as far away as I was afraid, and it's fairly accessible. I just don't know how I sort of collect it and stuff. Obviously, I need power. But... Anyway, where's this hard drive? It keeps devol defaulting to slugs. It's at the top there. Okay. And that takes us back down. So, looks like I can maybe jump across from here. Maybe if I build across, that's probably safer. Ramp. Ramp. Well, that's good that it's not that... How is it? Oh, it's power slugs. Yeah, it's here. There we go. Ooh, there's a few useful bits here. Clear bars. Wires. Now, what do you need? 
30 motors. Have I not got a motors bum? Okay. This is my this is my problem with it, you see. Not knowing I mean I know I could use the map to look it up and stuff, but that defeats the point, doesn't it? Uh so if I just build one of these. Can I make 30 motors? Because I should have. I think some of them have gone in a previous one, basically. Motors, there we go. Because I had 50. I was deliberately carrying around a bit of everything, you see. But it's obviously put the put some of the others in in a previous, you know, what should we call it one? So now we got sit here and make 30. Yeah, this is my problem with it. It's the whole you know, oh, you turn up and you realise, oh, you've not got this. Oh, you can't even make it. Got to come back to it. It's that that part of it that I don't, I really don't like. <sighs> so yeah, so I so say I'm hoping to get maybe ten hard drives. I don't think we'll do it because I've already been half an hour, but. Um, I'm hoping to get 10 more. Uh, there is one that's, you know, finished cooking, as it were, um, back at the main base. And then I got about three in the, the chest. Um, I think something like that, three or four. So, let's say if we can get up to about 10 or so, so I guess I need seven more. Um, then hopefully that will give us some of these good recipes people keep telling me are there. But... Um, I still haven't found any that I thought were like brilliant, but maybe that's because I don't really understand, you know, unless I understand the recipe. So like steel rods and stuff, it just seemed to be more resources required, and which seemed a bit pointless, really. Right, so you can let me do it now. Thank you. Okay, so, we know there's a slug somewhere this way, don't we? I think we might have to hoof it, basically, I'm not sure. The car's going to work around here, because it's not particularly drivable terrain. But this is what I mean about, so, the, the, the beasties seem to have stopped spawning, apart from the crabs. We seem to have gone from nothing spawns, to everything spawns at a ridiculous rate. To only crab spawn. Because we haven't seen a spitter or a, a hog or anything like that yet. And I was expecting to get swamped by spiders in that, that last cave. Oops. Oh, oh. <laughs> falling off then. Uh, I mean, we could go back to the car. I'm not sure it'll get through this river though. Uh, have we got any slugs in range? No slugs. Hard drives? No. 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 Uh, I think there is one. All the way over on the top of this, this like structure to the right of me. Strange to the right of me. Oh, there's apparently a purple slug. There aren't that many slugs either, so we're okay on that front. Slug. Uh, apparently there's a purple slug down there somewhere. So let's jump off. But yeah, it's apparently like all the way on the top of this. There we go. Where are you? It's up there, is it or something?
So it's over there somewhere. Okay. Well, that got louder when I pointed the thing up. So is it on top of here? Ah. Doesn't look like a, a purple slug. That looks like a yellow slug to me. Or have I just misidentified that? It says purple. Hmm. Where is that then? So it should be over here somewhere. It's not out of the water or something. There you go, so that's Bibbin. It's a Bibbin. Unless it means it's all the way up the top there. I'm looking for the, you know, sparkly light things. I can't see any. Can I get on top of this? Or is it like I fall off? Some of the things you can't actually stand on. What's the light? No, I won't let me stand on that one. I am confused as to where, where that's supposed to be. I think that's the entrance to the gigantic cave I was talking about. Wait, is that the... Ah, I see something there. Look. Like the little sparkly line. So maybe it's at the top there. So, if I do a little foundation. Sort of here, maybe. I can at least get a better look. So it's kind of expecting there to be spiders here. Ah, what's that? Well, that's yellow, though. Unless I'm in the wrong bit entirely. Oh, there's one. Well, there's one there. I can see it. There's one up there. Another yellow one. I see no purple. Hmm. Oh no, it's th there, I think. So I'm in the wrong section. Well, let's have a look at the map. Let's just, let's just cheat. If we're going to cheat, let's cheat. So purple. Yeah, it's it's back up. It's meant to be here. And it doesn't show that there's a cave, so that's weird. Because it's right opposite my vehicle. Hmm. Yeah, it's loads of blues. Basically, this whole thing here. I think there's meant to be a Couple, couple in this cave that we're sort of pointing at. Let's go and have a look at the cave anyway. I'll get my gun out. Annie, get your gun. Uh, sorry. So there's a marking sphere. Ooh. Well, that looks weird. It's texture change, I guess. Hmm. 
on top here. Giant chamber of some description. Oh, that looks like a destructible rock there, doesn't it? Need to be a little careful with the fuel, because um actually have that much. Ah, oh, there's a purple one there. So some of the challenge is just, you know, the spelunking side of it or whatever. Um, rather than there being beasts guarding them, but... Um, yeah, we haven't seen anything, have we, seen, apart from the, the dams. Oh, it's another one. You should have said. Is that a different room or? Heckins, my bob. So this takes us outside. Okay. Where does that alternate route go? By game, our senses are tingling. There are alternate routes. This is quite extensive. I say it must be amazing. Fun to, to build stuff like this. Or make rather stuff like this. There's a slug. Wee sluggy lad. Super duper. Can I see any other sparkles? Or let's get me. No? Nothing? Okay. That's over there, then. Ooh, okay. <laughs> That's a waterfall. Surprise waterfall. Suddenly, boom, out of nowhere. Surprise waterfall. So it don't look like natural rock structures. This is the big thing of... Is the whole... Whoops! Don't want to walk off there. Is the whole planet, you know, artificial... It's got to be, isn't it? Oh, well, yeah. Yes, it is, because it's made for a video game. But in the uh, fiction of the universe itself. So it could probably get up further up, but it's not giving me any slug readings or anything. I wonder if there's any hard drives. No. So going up there just feels like intellectual curiosity more than anything, I guess. Where was the entrance to this cave? Gotten lost now. Got some more blibs. Some more blibs. Where are you? Oh, is it that one again? It's that one again. It's not really any point going up there, is there? I think I'll jump across to that other... where that slug was. And we'll grab that one. But I believe, as I say, according to the map, this is quite a big structure. And there's like a hard drive over here. But I say there's meant to be a purple one there, which I'm puzzled by. Unless at some point I've come and grabbed it, but then it's not filled out the map if I have. Which seems a bit strange. I jump across to there. Will I reach that? I don't think I'll reach that, will I? 
Uh, maybe come from here. There's another one. Okay. Let's go up this way then. What's that? Oh, blimey, Nick. You, you're in the name here. It's up the top there somewhere. So it reminds me a lot of Red Dead Redemption 2, this clambering over the visas. Trying to find gold bars and stuff. <laughs> right. I gone past it. So most of oops. One of those uh whatever they are. So where are you telling me this slug is? Has this thing got a cave in it? So it's really a map. So I'm in there. I might have accidentally gone on the outside when the intention is to go in a cave. So I'm on... Oh, there is. There's a cave system. Quite a complex one as well. So I'm guessing the slug is actually like at the top of the cave system. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Mm -hmm. See, so, yeah, I'm guessing there's like a slug like in here, inside. Hmm. Have we got any? Are these sort of entrances or something? See, it's looking pretty awesome. I did all the like the roof and stuff as well. I've just gone with a simple tar roof. I've, I've, I've fairly determined to use everything. So how the heck do I get in this cave then? And it looked that the entrance was down this way. Lost. I lost on that. Unless it's un... No, it's not under the archway. Yes, beep, 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 but, but where is it? Ah, well, there's one there. Cool. Where the heck is the entrance to this cave then? Okay, 
Maybe it's at the surface level? Skaploosh. They're a bit rubbish with this. I mean, this is a waterfall. There should be stuff behind the waterfall. There, I mean, there are only a couple, but like every water should have, fall should have something behind it. That's like game design 101, man. Uh, right. I don't see it, so I don't, I don't know where the heck the entrance is. Spoosh. No. That was a shadow. Don't, don't worry, Ron. That was a shadow. Oh! What's that up there? How do I get up there? Across here, maybe. Have I got the legs? Yeah. I'll just jump up. Ah. Well, let's go in prepared. No, oh. not one of you. I don't want one of you. So it's like there's multiple caves. Okay. Anyway, wasn't there a slug over here somewhere? No. No. Oh. Right, let's go and get the car because it looks like this is a shallow river, so we should be able to drive along the river. Um, because it's the hard drives I'm most interested in, because it ended up getting so distracted there. Um, I mean, who'd have thunk, eh? Getting just oh, might be a bit too deep then. You're bibbing again, you're bibbing. Oh, hello. Well, that was a hard one to find. In fact, that I think is where the purple one should have been. Now I got ganked by a bunch of spiders when I came around the group before. Okay, looks like all all spawning apart from the crabs is gone then. Somebody somewhere keeps switching a flip, uh, switching a flip, flicking a switch. And there's got to be some combination of switch that works, but I clearly haven't found it yet. Where the heck has my car gone? Uh, oh, it's over there. Oh, crikey, I've gone way over. Okay. Right. Oh, we're bibbing again. There's more slugs. Or are these underground slugs? Well, that's not an underground slug, is it? That's one of them there standing out in the open slugs that I've clearly driven past because we drove this way. Yeah, I'd love to make a, love to make maps like this. Maybe when I'm retired, just work out how to use Unreal. Excuse me. Just sort of spend my time making bonkers maps. Are you gonna get? Let me go through there. 
Yeah, we should be able to follow the river around. Hopefully it isn't too deep. Because then we'll have to do the tedious deconstructing the vehicle. Now, which way am I going from here? I'm going. Wait. Actually, we wanted to go that way. How have I managed that? What? Because that bit goes out to uh, there. I wonder if the hard drive is accessible that way. Well, actually, I wanted to go that way, basically. Okay. I've confused myself. Hmm. Be good if you could fit, you know, like a tracker to the vehicle. Or the Exploder game with one attached, you know, so you could just sort of drive in the right direction. I'm going to get back this way, am I? Oh, no, looks like I can do vehicles. I can't get across there, though, can I? Because that's the waterfall. Well... Yeah, that worked. No, that's the waterfall there. I'm misunderstanding the understanding of map, I think. Okay, let's go the other way again then. Welcome to the stream where I drive backwards and forwards up a river. Hmm. Because I know where this bit goes. This goes out to the... the thing. To the big lakey bit. Oh, it's just like there. Now this, this, there were definitely some spiders in. Not that I'm paranoid or anything. Because it's also where there was that cave that I tried to go in. This one. Where, if you go in this cave... Well... We could try, but it's only got a, a Mercer in it. But when I, I tried to go in this cave before, and there's no floor. The floor's not... Shut up. The floor's not real, basically. It's not a solid floor, and I just fell through the map. Um, I might have fixed it, obviously, but... So I just literally fell through the map. Because it was these I'm not. Oh, what? Uh. That doesn't look right, does it? That looks like when in, like, Sim City Skyline, where you use the terrain increasing tool. Just look stretched. Are they meant to be anything? Hmm, odd. Your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. Now where's this hard drive? Out of range, really. Well, I suppose it would be because it's over here, I think. So let's just follow this round as far as we where's the car gone? As far as we can. I'm going to drive up there, am I? But might need to deconstruct the car. To get back, because that I've dropped it down a cliff. Hmm. 
Oh, there you go. Same thing here. Somebody's finger slipped, I think. It's just the terrain's been stretched up. Look a bit like termite mines, actually. Oh, mounds. Where is it? It's the, up the top there, basically. So it looks like we've got a little pathway up here. Now, is this a cave as well? I think this might be, because this is meant to be have a, a great big cave in it. But it didn't appear to have anything in it. Nope, it's just a little nook. Purposeless nook. Purposeless nook. Probably sort of brute force it by uh, just jumping up, jetpacking up. I will get to the top of here and it'll turn out it needs power or something. And it's like, I'm going to have to run power cables over. I did wonder about if a... Oh, here we go. If I could set up a bio burner and just fake it that way, basically. I can never remember how much they need. Any other bits? Any other little goodies? Some screws. One of them thingies. Oh, heat sink. Yeah, was that not that? There it is. Wires. What do you need? 30 motors again. Can I make 30 motors? Because I couldn't make them before. Have I picked up enough bits? Uh. Where are motors? Who a Estla motor? 20, but I can make more of those. So that might enable me to make more motors as well. I can't remember what the ratio is. It's like, i make 10 of those though. So I've got 50. One more. Not two more. And is this going to let me make more? Yeah, it's two to one with that, isn't it? So I should be able to get 30. Brilliant stuff. actually there we go 27 8 no need some more status look at the state of that thirty there we go so how are we doing on slopes? So we've got five of the blue, which is just one. I think the purple convert to two. No, the purple convert to five, don't they? So that's 10, 15, and they're two each. So that's another 24. So 15 plus 24 is another 39. 
And that adds to 33, which is 60, 70 odd in the end. How are we doing? 12. That's a bit better, 70 odd. That's happier with that. Because I needed about 30 to go into the steel. So, I mean, there's an element to these always. So, you can check the map and like more in more detail. Now, I'm just using it for vague guidance. But it does, you know, people have worked out and put down what, what each one is. But kind of, it takes what little fun there is out of it then, I suppose. But, um, I'd say that it becomes frustrating for me in the. Well, you found this thing. Now you've got to get exactly this number of that item, which is like just tedious. Two. Oh, one. There we go. Right, let's leave it. Make sure. Go. So, five hard drives. Four hard drives? Five hard drives. Four hard drives. So if we can get a couple more by the end of the stream, I will be happy. Now, according to these maps, there are no slugs here, basically. But there is, I say, there is a cave sort of on the end of this promontory, so sort of here. Apparently. How the heck you get in here? I don't know. We go have a quick look. As we go back for our car. I would have kept working on the I say the copper and steel foundry, but um so it's been so hot in the UK today. Uh, it's been edging into thirty degrees here and even hotter down south. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, I wouldn't be surprised if it's getting into the hundred range, which the UK is sort of not about unprecedented, but it's rare that we get temperatures like that. Um, luckily, I think it's a relatively short burst again. Um, but my air conditioner unit has been full blast, basically, all the um, last couple of days. But it doesn't help me with... Uh, well, it helps me get to sleep. Because it's nice and cool in the room when I go to bed, but I can't have it on, it's too loud. Um, got any caves? Cave entrances? Cave entrances? No. But yeah, I have to sort of turn it off. When I actually, you know, go to sleep, and then of course, five, you know, a few hours later, the room's heated up and it, it wakes me up then. So yeah, it's a bit of a struggle sometimes to get enough sleep when it's like this. I think with, you know, climate change and the fact no government is going to tackle it, I think like properly built-in air conditioning needs to become standard in the UK. Is this Kateri? Oh, it is. Okay. That's interesting. So yeah, big discovery is the nitrogen patch over there, I would say, because that's going to be... I think that I'll have to tap that to get... Oh, look, there's a little slug down there. I'll have to tap that to get... to build these, whatever they're called, super-duper mega structural frame lads. Um, I don't see a cave entrance. So what's in the cave? I don't know. I guess it's summer sloops and... All that business. I don't know if the is. No. Because the car should be down here somewhere. No. Whoops! I fell off then. No, didn't break the floor. Uh, yeah. I was curious, just curious to see where the cave entrance was, really. 
I know it's not got anything in it. So where was this slug? It was sort of over on this arch, wasn't it? The heck was that? Okay, that was a weird noise. Is it this arch? Can I climb this one then? Oh, if I can, I can't see through the the greenery, so we'll just build a thing up to it, I think. I wonder what that weird noise was. Um, right. Not walls. Yeah, I want to continue, but say at the factory because it's it's kind of nearing, you know, doneness. It's the belts really that I've been sort of avoiding again. You know, the under underbelly belts. But in terms of the machines, they're you know not far off being all powered and coloured in and all that sort of stuff that I do. Oh, this one there as well. We're not doing that badly for slugs. Oh. I see some blue dashy lines. Nice. There's another one. Okay. There, I guess. It's an easy way up there somewhere. Alright, there we go. There's one here. I mean, I sort of expect them all to be guarded by something, and we haven't seen anything apart from the, the crabs. Way up here, maybe? Uh, around this way, maybe? Oh, it's on there, look. Sneaky. Sneaky. There it is. City, this. It's great that they're all they're all yellow as well, which is two for one, Joe. Oh, that must be in some cave somewhere. No, not top then. Okay. If I go up here. And up here. Ah. 
purple as well. It feels like being a, a kid and sort of collecting marbles, really. Not marbles. I suppose nowadays it would be Pokemon and stuff, wouldn't it? So I never really did that. So run out of patience, basically. Is that a hard drive? Come on. Yeah, it is. Cool, okay. Can we grab that as well then? Can I walk across this? Yeah, okay. Right then. Hard drive. Watch it require more motors. I mean, we happen to be close to the main thing, but let's grab the bits and bits and bobs of goodies. It's not too many. Ten rotors. We used them all to make the thing, didn't we? So we should be able to make ten more, hopefully. Production half inch. Ten rotors, I think it said. We're getting it back to the. Um, and I need to get my car. Okay, so that's number five. Now, where's my car? All the way over there. Does the map say there's any other hard drives around here? Mm -hmm. Kind of on top of this whole whole business here. So up here, there's apparently a hard drive. I wonder how the heck I get up there. The brute force it, obviously. Is that right? That doesn't look right then. Maybe they've not updated the map on Satisfactory Map. Because this lake looks different on uh, on the thing. But yeah, apparently there's, there's one. Here. So I think this has been updated. And Satisfactory Maps hasn't because it doesn't look right. We're going to have a look. Might as well. Be cool to see what's on top of this structure anyway. Uh, I think we'll sort of brute force it again. Unless I can see an obvious way up. Power slug as well. Okay. Can get this way? to jump that. Oh, there's one over there as well. Look. Well, and that should be relatively easy to build across then. Let's go with a couple of in fact, I wonder if something like that basically gets all the way over. Did I just see one here as well? Oh, there's one there. I seem to remember reading a thing that said the desert was, like, you know, the most heavy area for slugs. Right, so we kind of need to get back up. 
as you do. I wonder if I can just... build my way up. So, power slugs, uh, not power slugs, hard drives. No? Oh, I wouldn't be on that even up. Not even on the top yet. Um, can I build across there? So if we go maybe there somewhere? More power slugs, eh? Mmm. It's a whole oasis thing. This is kind of cool. I like this. This is a nice, nice bit of the map. Interesting. Not much here then. kind of awesome yeah I don't, these these things you know are clearly transporting water and I don't know whether they're meant to be broken like that or the idea is they you know have become broken over time because they, they're, they're not you know natural structures unless the entire planet is meant to be some animal or something Is there a way up here? Um, oh, it's because it's on power slugs. I, I was wondering why it wasn't doing anything. Wait. Unless it's got... Oh, I'm nowhere near it. It's over here somewhere. I thought it must be on the top of there, but it isn't. It is an enormous map. I don't know why they've made so much of it sort of unbuildable. I guess it sort of makes sense to make it an exploration challenge as well. But you couldn't really sort of build over here. And again, nothing, nothing guarding this you know, crash site. Any more little treats? Any treats? Yeah. What do you need? 30 motors, which we definitely cannot make. Can't see how we can make them. Because we wouldn't have enough rotors. Because each motor is two and two. So we'd only be able to make like five. I think I've got a couple in my inventory of nine. They're made from rods and screws. And I can't make any rods. I could make a million screws though. Wait, why can I only make 11 of those? Oh, because of the screws. Okay. It's really heavy on screws. So we could make a load of screw. We might be able to just squeeze this in because I do have quite a few rods. I'm going to have to turn the rod production back on 
I, I thought I'd, I would be at the stage where I was reworking that factory before I ran through all of the rods, but I'm nowhere near doing that, so I'm going to have to turn the, the rods factory back on again. Which is a little bit annoying. I mean, we could go and work on it, but the trouble is it then I don't have any rods unless I finish the iron and copper foundry. This is going to take a small ice age, isn't it? Because I need... 15... So I need 20 just to make 10. We're probably better off just to go and get some. There's like an entire chest of them. What do you need? 30 motors. So I would need to make... 60. And these require 25. That's going to take ages. Isn't it? In fact, I've just run out. Right? So I need... That's only going to make me... It's not going to make me it. Any motors, why not? Well, come on, what do I say? Why can't I make any motors? Oh, because I haven't got stators either. Okay. There's no point doing this, because it will be here all day. Right. Get rid of it. So can I put a tank? It wouldn't let me put one of these on. Why is, oh, it's not. It's because they're not. It's not showing them because they're not active here. Because I turned them off. Map markers. There we go. No, I want to delete it, please. So is there one up here as well? Oh, I put it in the air. There we go. Messed it up. Right. So that there. So this need. Um. Let's drive needs thirty motors. Okay, so we know that's uh, uh, something we need to do. According to the substrate map, there isn't really anything up here. See, it's just not giving any signals for slugs. Right, so we've got our cars all the way back there. But we can jump off a cliff to get it. Like you do. So there is there was there's an indication there's a cave here somewhere as well, but I don't know where that is. Now there's a bunch of hard drives in the um like the valley, as it were, the you know the valley between the thing, whether they're all still there or not, I don't know because this satisfaction map doesn't appears to be the old map. Um, I know there's one, but if you, so this I've got my steel factory is here with where the right is, and there's one there, but I don't think I've picked up. And I think I got one. I know there's one, sort of here-ish. I've driven past a load of times. But yeah, a bit of a revelation that there's nitrogen there. Which geezers are these, though? I don't know what they are, is the problem. I think they're just, like, steam, so power ones, effectively. Hmm. Right, let's go fly a kite. this direction I suppose this top plateau isn't unbuildable as it were but you'd have quite a job sort of bringing stuff up here because the trucks would fail to drive up this incline I just can't do it oh does this go down to the yeah this goes down to the like edge of the cliff 
see a slug there actually. Can I cars in off here? I think so. Yeah, there's one on that, that top there, isn't there? It's too far away to build. Or is it? I could just build a cross. Well, it's just going to be, oops, wrong one, littered with these random bits of, you know, concrete that I've just built to access slugs and stuff. Oh, we got some of the plants here. This is what I was saying. I was expecting, or well, there should be things guarding everything. That's like the other thing they do. And instead we've got nothing. Which suggests to me, go up a little bit actually. But, uh, something's been turned off somewhere, not intentionally. Let's figure out that bit. Come on. There, maybe. Can I get rid of these plants? I don't know if there's anything up here else. But you're always a pain in the bum, aren't you? I bet there was a hard drive on that. I should have checked, shouldn't I? It's my own. So a bit of a trek back to the car. Good to get your steps in, though, you know. Well, if that's not a destructible thing, I don't know what is. Because that would line up with where I was expecting the cliff to be. Let's see if we can blow these up as well, then. I suspect this is more of a curiosity one, than Because I don't think there's any slugs in here or anything. We have weirdly floating, weirdly floating rocks. Oh, light changed. Oh, it's just one of these guys again. Because there's no. No, there's no slugs. So eventually, end get you know when the story reveals itself, I'm sure that'll be all very useful to collect. But at the moment, it's just a bit of an annoying thing. Okay. Whoops! Whoops! I mean, I'd love to design something like this. Great fun. Big fun. There's a slug on there as well. I wonder if that was the one I was detecting earlier. Can we walk across that? This one? 
It's absolute. There's absolutely full of them. I didn't know there were so many. There's this one over there as well. Whoops. Uh, just to brute force all out. You say there's like one there. I don't know if you can see that one. Wasn't there one on this here as well? Anyway. Another one of these. I don't want these. Hmm. Relaying message. Hello, this is Paternal Figure. Oh. I have taken ill. Oh I need your help to find a cure. Doctors say that the only remedy is alien artifacts. Now, where's the cup? Just over there. Okay. Perfectly part. Perfectly part. Right then. So we're heading to the sort of alley bit. See if we can't find some uh, hard drives in there. I need a couple more for what I was aiming for. Yeah, loads of slugs. Wasn't expecting it to be quite so many. There we go. Be worth checking out the geezers as well, because they're just random as well. I'm pretty sure they're power ones. You know, steam ones, but we can have a quick look. A quick boucher. Right. I think they're around this way, because there should be oil somewhere here. I got my location wrong. Well, they're clearly guarding, guarding something. What are you guarding? It's one of these. Wait, why didn't I blow that one up? Yeah. There's one of them. You are so lucky that you found this valuable artifact. Yeah, it's one of those lads. Oh, for Pete's sake. Hard drive. This way, okay. Oh, well, there's a slot there as well. Let's get a car. from Earth. Widespread chaos and mayhem. World President urges all citizens to do their part and harvest alien artifacts. See, I quite like the things they say. It's just they repeat, repeat them over and over and over and over and over again, so it gets a bit annoying. Right. 
Where is this hard drive? It's up here somewhere. On top of that, maybe? Or crashed at the bottom? Wow. Now there's there's a there's a cliff. Where's this hard drive? Oh, is it the one in here? Isn't the one in here? Let's just get out and have a check where it wants me to go. Oh, it's not in there, no. Here somewhere? No. Oh, it's detecting that slug up there. I wonder why it doesn't hold the... Hold the thing you're after. Whoops. Oh, there's a couple of slugs in this tree, aren't there? Hmm. I wonder if I can make it up there. I think better to build across, maybe. It seems to be saying it's up here. Again, it's lost the recipe. That way? How can it be that way? What? So it's that way, but we've managed to not see it. What? It's below me. Oh, here we go. It's on the ground level all along. On the ground level all along. Watch it be another 30 rotors. I didn't go and get any, did I? Any other treats? Oh, this time we've got it. No, we haven't. 20 megawatts. Brilliant. Thanks for that. Right. I mean, I should have power running along the valley. But where? I don't know. Probably just head off in this direction. So, let's grab that. That there. Yeah. Maybe out this way? I don't know if it's this far up. Ah, there we go. There's me found. Can you connect? Yes, you can. There we go. So I particularly hate the power ones. Just seems a bit daft. Right. 
There we go. Need a bit of a meal on that. So we'll find, if we can find one more in the last 20 minutes, then goal is achieved. There's not one close. Now where am I? So not where I thought I was. So that's that one there. Yeah, so if we head back sort of down the valley, there should be a couple, but as I say, whether or not, you know, they're ones that have been moved because of the map update, I don't know. Um, we'll have to see. We can also set the geezer should be over that way, according to the map. Geezer. He's a right geezer. I don't know where my car is. All the way over that way. I was about to go in the cave, wasn't I? Should have a car detector on it, this. Straight on. There it is. Oh, look, can you see there? The surface is going down as we approach. <laughs> Must be a log thing. Um, am I going the right way? Tempting little sluggy over there. Nice and easy to access. Just grab that one. But yeah, geezer should be that way. I could ping it actually. See which one it is. Okay. Is that the one I was expecting? No. Okay. So... Oh, of course it's going to be easier, isn't it? There's them there. Just that one. I just want to make absolutely sure it is like a power thing, because it'd be good to hook that up as well. This way. Here we go. Why? That's going to be crunchy. Oh, it's a slug as well. These are impure. So, will it let me put geothermal? Yes, so that's a power one, isn't it? Okay. Okay. We see, there should be, I know for a fact, because when I was here before, there should be some spitters. All right. We haven't got any spitters. Still, we've got these ugly little leaders. Right, let's get this slug then. Find these last hard drives if we can. Oh, so one of you left. There is. Right then. Because it shows on a map like there's three of them. 
Let's ping it again. Oh, I see this one there as well. So it's not three, it's two. Oh, oh okay, so those are geezer geezers. What I'd really like to do is scan for hard drives. I think that would be a more useful way than, you know, this thing. Right. Let's get out of here. In the most unceremonious way possible. Yeah. Yeah, so there should be a couple of hard drives here and I, th I think one of them's one I've driven past here we go a million times and again there should be spitters here because it's always guarded by spitters and there's nothing here is there so yeah they must have turned them back off again Right, what do you need? You just need some rubber. That's excellent. I can certainly give you some rubber. So that's seven. That was what I was hoping for. Well, with the other three I've already got. So that gives me ten. So let's see if we can get a couple of bonus ones. Or is there one up? Hmm. Let's just check on that. Just reckons that one is. But it reckons there's one on the side of the cliff, basically. Not sure if I can reach that. So it reckons... Oh, there it is. There, look. Maybe I can build up to it. It's not too far away. It's too far away, isn't it? Um, I can build up to here. And then maybe across to there. Oh, I've run out of run out of concrete. A slug up here as well. Okay. Hopefully, I can. No, that looks a bit dodgy now. Uh, let's go it. Ramp. And we can add uh, not too many. So we take it to say there, and then to here. Because this appears to be poison central. Watch it need power. Yeah, 10 power, 10 megawatts. So we've got the screws, just haven't got this 10 megawatts. So, let's hook it up. No, I can't. It's the wrong bit, isn't it? So you hook that one up. Mm. Oh, maybe put it on there. Come on. If you connect down to the surface, you will. Oh, my power's all the way over there. Okay. Take 
Uh, right, so that's that bit. Trouble is, how do I get back up there? I could just fly. This bit, I'm never going to make that that jump, am I? Get that out. Uh, maybe if I just grab some of them. Ramp in on this side. That's not very high up, is it? Um, maybe a ramp. Yeah. That. It's probably some super easy access in the other direction. Oh, oh, auto save. Auto save, you little cheeky, cheeky auto save. Okay, there we go. Why seriously still in a gas range? That seems a bit harsh. No, just thinking I'd bug that. You, you, this. Right then. It's a bit of an adventure. Now, there should be another one that I say I keep sort of driving past. I think. I think. There's a slug there as well. I'm sure these. Oh. Sure, these won't mind me taking these slugs. this other one I keep driving past? I'm not sure it's on the surface as such. I think it's like up on the side or something like that. Or it was. I mean, it's me where they've gone. Is it round here? Let's pop out and get the old scan again. That's a range. Oh, okay. Maybe it's not. Maybe I already grabbed it. So. Oh, it's a fair way. Oh, and it's on the top anyway. It's not. Oh, no, it isn't. No, it's on the right. Or it was. I think over there somewhere. It's difficult to tell because this is the bit where the map has changed quite heavily. But these two, like here, so there should be something on this. Well, there used to be something on this, this you know, bit here, I think. I think that's what that's telling me. I say whether it is or not, I don't know. But certainly, it's not giving a hard. Oh! Yes, it is. We're just too far away. Look at them underneath. Um, 
Let's get you. Oh, there's one there. You gonna open? Right, so where's my scanner? To hard drives. Is there something up here, maybe? Ah, uh, is that it up there? Very much is. Uh, screws there. No. Forty megawatts. Of course it does. Of course it does. You're not going to let me pick them up. I'm oh, not enough space. Wow. Okay. Well, I don't need those. Not enough space, okay. Uh, let's go with that then. Can I get the slightly too far to reach? I think jump on there, maybe. Oh, no, is that connected? I think so. If I go, whoops, if I go here again. Like so. Yeah. Over the door. That's number nine. It's not the same as any others. Okay. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's the actual thing, isn't it? Right, let's get rid of these. Cool. So we've got nine in the end. Um, oh, we could head back to the main base, I guess, because I'm not sure there's not some... I haven't sort of, you know, driven past a load of times there as well. Um, but that's kind of it for today. Bit of a just sort of chill one, really. You know, collecting hard drives and falling off stuff and all of those sorts of adventures. Hopefully next fr this coming Friday it will be a little cooler. I have a feeling it's going to go back up again. But um, where's my car gone? There it is. But yes, I'll hopefully do a bit of um, building, both in the meantime and, and on that stream. Um, what I'm really hoping, let's just head back to bed. I don't mind going a little long today. No, it's starting to cool off, actually. But, um, whoops. My eyes peeled if I see any hard drives as we go, but I don't think there's any up here. I believe I think there's one up like up on the cliff there somewhere. Not, oh right, there's one up there. Look, oh no, that's a miner I think that I might have put up there. But yes, so um, it's good that those are power geezers. And the ones in the um, marshland appears to be power geese as well. So that gives a little boost. I can also show you the, the sort of issue I was having with the... In fact, it would be good to check this. Is it... Oh, I know. I need to switch back. 
is it says oh it's doing this again it started doing this before where it just infinitely you're going to infinite lift mode there you go so it's not it's got like not got any sort of spare fuel in it why are you doing that because it's they're not backing up like a reserve and there's a, an element of just in time delivery and that's with me having turned them all down to 90 percent I mean, I'm assuming the burn rate change. That might be wrong, might not it? Does the burn rate change if it is reduced? Huh. I don't actually know. I mean, that would be the most logical thing. In the same way that if you increase the output, it should burn them faster. I don't know that for a fact. But yeah, these dips are where there's one just not arriving in time. So, we, I mean, a simple solution might be just to boost the belt speed um, so that they arrive quicker, because there is a long lag t lead time from production to this end one. But so that's kind of happened, because I messed up one of the steel foundries in there. Um, and those are filling up a lot quicker than I thought they would. The steel, the chests. But yeah. Well, that's the problem. So it's sort of, it's almost like just in time delivery. Oh no. This is the annoying thing it does with the. Because I can't now pick that up. In fact, I shouldn't have done that with my inventory full. I bet I won't be able to. I can't. Right, so let's put some stuff in here. Just to get rid of it, really. Put slugs in or something. Random bits. Now hopefully I can pick it all up. No. There go. Yeah. Okay. You're just going slightly too deep a little bit of water and it ejects you out of it. Um... Because you're saying we, we, the only enemies we've seen are crabs, those those flying gnat midge things, and that's it. We've not seen a single spitter, we've not seen a hog, we've not seen a spider, not seen one of those giant spiders, no mini spitters, no big spitters. So yeah, is that does that mean it's broken? It's turned off. Because most of the places we went, I I don't I haven't built I haven't any got any built structures, so they shouldn't have despawned for that reason. So I think there's a hard drive over here somewhere. No. No. <laughs> Thought we might just get the tenth one. Get a tenth one, but nope. What well, over there, Guardian? I've obviously picked that. Was it over here, maybe then? No. May have already grabbed it. But... Okay. Let's head back to the old factory. Because I know I've already... Well, I think I've already got this one. Would have been an obvious one to get. Doesn't like that. Well, 
Okay. Can I swap these under this amount? Um. Yeah, so I say there should be one that's that's cooked. They still take ten minutes the hard drive. They didn't they didn't reduce the time for that one. They reduced the times on a lot of, a lot of the researches, the man speed and all that sort of thing. Mm. But it's these high these um super mega frame thingies. Because these all the way down here. Wait, have I not even Modular frame, maybe modular frame. Oh, are they not even in the listing? No, no, they're not there, are they? Unless you have to make them in this. I don't know why you would do. No? Yeah, why is that not? Fused modular frame, that's the badger. Yeah? You see, it requires nitrogen. But it only requires 1 and 50. So if I need to make... Let's have a look at the other one. So I need to make 50 for that milestone. And I need to make... 200 for that milestone. Uh, you see, this is a problem. The one I want to unlock requires turbo motors and cooling systems so they're gonna and there are lots of them and also the actual control rats okay but I mean I'm making them sort of I could also to help with this whole lag issue with the power I could shut it off and it will just make a load of them you know maybe stick them in a chest or something but yeah I, I need to do this one to unlock the two things or certainly that one can I already make them cooling systems just like I could, in theory, make them. But um, I need to do it so I can do the turbo motors. Um, so i kind of got to do them anyway. And that also gives me about three miles. But they need need these things, I think. Uh, but you see, it's, it's some gas. Which I think that means... Because it's made in a blender. So I could just feed the nitrogen gas into it. So if I can hook that nitrogen gas up. Take over, say... Well, what would it be? It would be like... Well, a huge stack of the framey things and that's it and it'll make the 50 I need there and the 200 so I need 250 and I say I'm so, I'm making them but you know not storing them and then it's those two are a bit more problematic what do they need see it needs hydrogen again uh, well that needs water as well and I don't even know what the recipe is for that but yeah I, you know we could do that because I got loads of supercomputers not here particularly unless there's some more in here yeah but in various you know factories I've just left a load of supercomputers um, but yeah so uh, so this is analysis complete alternate steel coated plate which is made from steel ingots and plastic I guess it must the thing the difference must be that it comes from the number that you get because to me, because plastic is a bit of a pain to make, you see, and steel is a bit of a pain to make. It, but it must just be that you get so many, they become good recipes. But you see, to me, that, you know, you make iron plate by just smelting iron. It's, you know, raw iron. And in order to make this one, I mean, the, the iron's coming in. I guess, so it's 3 to 18, isn't it? So we would add, but you have to find 3 um, coal and three and two plastic and of course that's a whole complicated chemical chain so it's like maybe it is way 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 more efficient but it's a super complicated chain to set up so the standard recipe so that's a better one I think because these are like two to one because that's three becomes two but I think the other ones require like four or something it would help if it gave you like the raw breakdowns on like it does in Factoria. 
And that might be quite good. Although, again, heat sinks. I'm not making heat sinks. Um, but they don't look that complicated. But anyway, let's just do that one. Because, wow, that was loud. Blimey. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, let's just stick another one in. But they see, these still do take 10 minutes. Um, but yeah, so, so that's it for today. Um... Uh, I'll kind of just cook all of these off and I'll make the slides and I'll do a bit of sorting out and tidying up. But um, So the biggest issue I've got, and I would definitely will do this before the stream, whether I do any other building. But I've, this is like all of, all of the rods I've got, basically. That's it. So I've got to go and turn that factory back on. It's also not, you know, so the iron plate I turn back on. There's no screws, but I don't really need screws. I could turn some of them on. Um... Yeah, and I've got loads of... But it's all backed up. I'm pretty sure that's why this is so lumpy. Because it's the fuel is not really working. Um, it's, not, it's not disposing of the plastic and stuff quick enough, basically. But yeah, so, so that's it for today. Hmm. I wonder how many of these I've made. Four more. So how many have we got in total? 13 in total. So I don't think I've got anything useful left to buy. It's all the sort of statues and stuff. Uh, so that's all the equipment, so that's all infinite. Got parts. Ah, so you can make, you can buy turbo, 50 turbo motors. So that might be an alternative, and you can buy heat sinks. Instead of making them, I just buy turbo motors. Because I would need, if I've got 13, I need another three. Okay. And then the specials are obviously the super sinking things. Oh, huh, that's interesting. Okay. We got 13? Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, that's a thought. A thought for another time. So, uh, put me schedule up. It's wrong for next week. Well, I say that. I don't know what's going on with the Grand Prix again, but it's the French Grand Prix. Although, I'm kind of expecting all the Grand Prix to be quite good this year because of the changes they've made to the era. The French Grand Prix has been rubbish the last few years. It's a terrible track. Um, but yeah, so uh, that's it for this week weekend. This was this weekend's schedule. Um, I say it may well revert back to the 3 p.m. starts, but I might have to get used to doing later starts anyway because, um, say, job is probably not going to allow me to. Well, I was actually chatting with her today, and the person, um, I shouldn't be saying this, I haven't probably, probably signed it up, but. It might be flexy, so it could still stay. But anyway, the point is, next week, I will be streaming the full gamut of streams, but the exact times might change. I might be back to 3 p.m. I might all do them at 4 p.m. Or, or something like that. I don't know, because because I don't know what the schedule is for the, for the race. Uh, but Friday, we'll be back for Satisfactory. Um, I say hopefully back to building, if temperature sort of falls off a bit. Um, if not, I don't know what I'm going to do, but um, I say we'll, we'll do something um, to make these things get closer to finishing. Um, maybe we'll get a good recipe out of the... Because I'm, what I'm hoping, because the big factory I've not done, is oil. And I'm hoping there's some good alternate oil recipes, and I can start I can use them instead. Because the amount of oil I've got to build is absolutely insane. Um, so I'm hoping there's some good oil recipes, but that's... Fingers crossed, type territory. Uh, Factorio, Saturday and Sunday, I'm going to be doing the um, Blueprint series and the Aesthetic series will come back after a little bit of a, a while away. I won't be playing Crash Story 2 uh, because I'm going to just play that. I'll probably just leave it running offline um, and basically get through the, the thing. And then when we come back with that, it will just be to finish it off. And I will probably start Angels, I think. Um, the angels overhaul. I'm not going to do Bob and Angels at the same time. Just Angels, I think. Um, 
But yeah, so that's all of the schedule and etc. Uh, if you're watching other VODs and you're sort of or you're new to the channel, that's my uh, Twitch address. There is just Tris Majestus. Uh, follows very much appreciated and, and all that sort of gubbins. But don't, don't think you have to. It's, it's fine if you just uh, drop her in. Uh, I have a YouTube channel which is alias to Triggles. That is because it is easier to say. I feel, uh, but it has all of my VODs on. So if you want to catch up on this series or like well like the Aesthetic Factorio series, the um blueprint series my mega base series my um a spoon no spoons run series all of that's on on the youtube as well as dyson sphere program um that's on there uh twitter is also to treat girls if you wanted to follow me and uh just see when i post when i go live and then there's the discord the aim of the discord is to do multiplayer i'd quite like to do a multiplayer stream of some description particularly factorio uh, and that's where i'll be trying to set that up so if you're interested in that please join the discord it will be a little while because i will have irl stuff going on so it probably won't happen but uh, if you would still if you want to play you know privately off, offline then you know give me a ping and we can try and set something up um although as i say it's going to have to work around my schedule so that's it so there we go i'm sure everyone's left if there was anyone watching i normally do during that bit but if you have been watching thank you very much i hope you've enjoyed it and you, and you might consider coming back for another one I've been Chris Magistus. This has been Satisfactory. Thanks for watching. Cheers.